China's Tiangon-1 space lab will likely fall to Earth between March 30th and April 2nd, according to the latest prediction by the European Space Agency's Space Debris Office in Dermstadt, Germany. This window is highly variable, not ironclad, Space Debris Office representatives stress in the updated forecast, which was issued on March 21st. Tiangong-1 was lofted in late September 2011 to help test the docking and rendezvous technologies required to build a bona fide space station, which China aims to do by the mid-2020s. The first Chinese orbital docking occurred between Tiangong-1 and unpiloted Shenzhou spacecraft on November 2nd, 2011. Two pilot missions were completed to visit Tiangong-1, Shenzhou-9 and Shenzhou-10 in June 2012 and June 2013, respectively. Meanwhile, ESA will serve as host and administrator of a test campaign regarding the re-entry of the space lab conducted by the Interagency Space Debris Coordination Committee. It's unknown where exactly Tiangong-1 will fall back to Earth, but given the spacecraft's inclination, it will re-enter somewhere between 43 degrees north and 43 degrees south latitudes. Owing to the Chinese station's mass and construction materials, there is a distinct possibility that some portions of the Tiangong-1 will survive the fiery journey through Earth's atmosphere and reach the surface, experts say. Now, information with this space station is constantly changing. We'll keep you updated as best we can right here. Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching.